welcome to today's vlog. Today we are chatting all about social media and things you can do rather than go on social media because I have given it up for Lent and I have absolutely flipping loved it. I'm not gonna lie, probably one of the best things I've done in a very long time and not being on social media has taught me quite a lot of things. So I'm gonna be baking some cupcakes because we all know that I love a bit of a bake and also my mum wants me to bake some because we've got visitors which is very classic. But that's one thing that you can do about like instead of going on social media, you know, bless people by baking. There's loads of things you can do. So basically, we're just gonna bake, we're gonna chat about it, we're gonna chat about Easter, about Lent, but mainly things to do other than social media, because there's hundreds. And I, I, I've got maybe like five, but I bet there's hundreds. I should probably Google it, but then it'd probably take me to an Instagram link of things to do, not on social media, on Instagram, so that'd be a bit weird. But first, let's get what I'm gonna make. I'm gonna make some hummingbird cupcakes, I think. So today we're talking about social media, obviously. I gave up social media for Lent. Flipping, loving it. Here are the good things and the bad things about it. The challenges are, I can't promote anything that I do, and I know that's quite self, like, self-promoting. It is, I'm not gonna even lie to you. It really is, and that's not why you should have well, if you think about it, right, social media is literally promoting things. And I'm not promoting myself, like, I don't post those pictures on myself. I don't try and do that. But things like tear fun videos and um, just, like, luminosity, a festival that I help out out. Help out? out? Help out at. I can't, like, put any promo on Instagram or share things. That's one thing that I'm struggling with. Apart from that, though... <laughs> It's amazing, right, three teaspoons of baking powder. Because I just think when you're not on social media, you're so much more present in the moment. I'm reading more books. I'm taking less photos, to be honest. I wish I was taking more photos. I think it's made me more aware that whenever I take photos, it's mostly because I want to put them on social media, which is not why you should take photos. You should take photos for your own memory and for your joy. This meant to come off. Oh my gosh, I almost got. Flip it, eh? Come on, what are you doing to us? <laughs> oh, that was not that hard. Okay, cool. Every cupcake case I put down, and there's a lot of flipping cupcake cases, I have to think of a different thing to do rather than social media. Number one, learn an instrument. I've actually been playing the piano recently and I flipping love it and when I'm at uni I find it really difficult because I'm like the piano I have like a little midi keyboard but it's it's really not great like you have to plug it into garage band and it's like really tiny you can't really sing to it and enjoy it but when I get home playing the piano mm, so one of the things is to learn an instrument another thing is learn a language over lockdown actually me and my granny my granny and grandpa they go to Tanzania every year um, they work at a hospital there for like half the, not half the year, like three or four months, maybe two months, two to three months. But um, they go there and my mum, my granny sometimes teaches English, so she kind of knows Swahili, but like, yeah. And we tried to learn Swahili together over lockdown and it was very interesting, but it was a lot of fun. And so learn the language and do it with a friend because it does make it a lot more entertaining. This is going to take a long time. Uh, third, um, do a puzzle, why not, we'll add that in. Four, um, have you played Wordle? I know this is on your phone, so maybe this isn't great, but Wordle is actually so great. I actually love flipping Wordle. I only ever do it in social situations though. Five, go on a walk. It is spring, lads. It is so nice outside. If you're not enjoying the sunshine, then what are you doing? We are British, we hardly get sunshine at all so you might as well enjoy it when we have it number six um read your bible why not you literally so i have my bible up and the news up right next to each other and i'm always like oh which one do i go on and i always accidentally press the bible and i'm like oh i want to go off it but then i still try and read it like if i go on it and also in the book in the morning i read um a bit of the bible a day and i journal and that is so lovely and my seventh one is going to be to journal Hi mate, I keep getting hiccups. Write down what's going on in your life, because in 10 years, 
your nosy self will be so intrigued and telling your kids it will be so much fun if you have like a little momentum of what was going on. I just think it's so cool to have like an, a journal. My seventh one is make a God journal. Have different like books for different things. So I have a journal for like my regular stuff and for um, regular, oh this is really annoying me. For regular life and then I have a journal for what God is telling me and I absolutely love it because I can look back and see how God is working. Okay, I'm only gonna fill this trait or else it's gonna take ages. Next one is to play a board game. I feel like board games, I never play them, but whenever I do, I really enjoy it, unless I lose, but we don't, we don't think about that. Um, how many have I done? Three, six, eight, no, three, six, eight, two, six, nine. Oops, my mathematics. Number 10 is, um, like play card games. I know this is very similar to board games, but one of my friends for Christmas bought me double, and in my flat it just stays there, and we have so much fun. Like maybe there's like two of us in the flat, and we'll just start playing double, and then everyone will come and join, and we just have random spontaneous double moments, and it is so good. So play card games. Uh, number eleven, bake. There we go. Do some baking. See, it's so lovely as well because you can be generous with the people and love on people with your baking. And number 12, go for a run. I know I said go for a walk before, but people always are like, no, I can't run, I don't do that, that's not me. Why? Why isn't it you? I think people need to enjoy running a bit more and love that. So there you go, there's my 12 things that you can do instead of going on social media. Okay guys, so it's about three hours later since I did it, but look, there's the cakes, they look very cute. Lucy, you're gonna come into frame. Oh, Lucy's just doing her hair. Whoa, sorry guys. But it's a lovely day today. So I went in the sunshine, went for a walk, went to a prayer meeting. Yeah. Did you guys, okay, if you're at uni, find out if there's a Just Love near you because I'm back in Manchester, but my friend in Manchester leaves the Manchester one. So if you're a Manchester and a uni student, hit me up. But if you're at university, find a Just Love because they're literally the coolest place to meet Christians who are passionate about justice, to have fun that are like, Bezzy mates with them, so we're all we're all working for the same thing. Oh, I dropped one. <gasps> she dropped one. <laughs> it's good, it's good. I'll have that one. Yeah. Actually, if I say for more, do you know what I mean? Oh. Yeah, I just don't tell anyone. The floor's clean. No one will know. Okay, uh, so here we have Lucy. You guys know these people. Uh, that's Lucy. Toby, say hi. Um, I was gonna ask. Yeah. Uh, what can we do to reduce the amount of time we spend on social media? What um, do you do instead of going on social media? What do you do instead? As in like, TV. when you're not... <laughs> watch Netflix. <laughs> no, guys! Right, so Lucy and Toby basically saying fight social media addiction with Netflix addiction. If you, if um, I think reading a good book, I think obviously people find that quite hard. So you need to make sure you get a good book, because at the moment I'm trying to read a book, but it's, I'm not getting into it, so... Do you like the book you it is really Wait, good. What, what book do you um, recommend? If anyone wants to watch. Ooh. You know what guys, if you're struggling for a book to read, I filmed a video literally not long ago. Yeah. Oh, by the way, best advice I'd give you, delete TikTok. Yes! The amount of time I spent on TikTok was insane. And I've deleted it and I'm not on my phone. I'm on my that phone nearly two hours last night. No! Yeah. It's just kind of Here's mine. So my daily average, look at me. Oh no, mine's actually really bad. 49 minutes. Oh, is that? Oh, oh that's, there's that's proof. That's so impressive. Proof. Okay, wait. wait it's general, compared to other I people. I daily oh, use my right. phone much. What are your voice yours, Luke? Okay, let's get mine. Oh, mine's gone up. <laughs> <laughs> when I deleted TikTok, it went down. No, 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 no. I it's just gone up from, so today I've only spent an hour and 45 minutes on it. <laughs> Today I've only spent an hour and 45 minutes on, which is pretty good. Um, What's your daily average now? Three hours. Mine might be a bit higher. So that's that's a oh, daily. Mine's on Google Maps though. Oh. Four hours? <laughs> Daisy's what? daily average, four hours wait, and 26 wait, minutes. Wait, what's the thing that I use? Yeah, go on, her, go on her like stats. Oh my goodness, Daisy. <laughs> Messages, three hours. That is including FaceTime. No, is it? it does not. Yeah, because yeah, where's FaceTime on that? Oh, yeah. Social media, four hours and 22 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Don't. Oh, no! <laughs> 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 Wait, 
That's because messages is coming. Oh, okay. Oh my gosh. <laughs> We've found out our screen time now. So mine is the best. Yeah, so you obviously all need tips from me. <laughs> okay, guys. We hope you have a lovely time. We hope you've enjoyed this oh. video. And that we have right, taught sure. you something about social media. <laughs> and um, have fun. Mm -hmm. See you later.